I've been hacking life for years. Not because I have no money, but because I'm mostly bored. Just kidding, it's because I have no money. I've snuck into movie theaters, baseball games, theme parks, nightclubs, and concerts. But the hardest place to break into is Hollywood. And I've lived here my whole life. I've always wanted to be in movies, so for this hack, I'm gonna break into Hollywood. First step, sneak myself into a big studio movie. Specifically, Paramount Pictures' Paranormal Activity Next of Kin. The best part is, these movies always have creepy characters running around, so maybe they won't notice me. I'm Mike Capes, and I call this one the Background Hacker. One day. So why did I pick the legendary paranormal movie franchise? I love horror movies, and this particular series always delivers. And also, I have a man on the inside. Before, if you wanted to get into a movie, you had to get inside a man. I have a buddy who's a big time PA now. He gets coffee for people like nobody's business. And he made the mistake of telling me he's working on a big upcoming movie. I did him a huge favor in college. I exposed his cheating girlfriend by sleeping with her to prove the point. Hey, hey. So he owes me big. For his protection, we'll just call him John. That's my real name. But you don't spell it with an H. Oh. Well anyway, John, or this guy, I mean this person, gave me the insider intel. This particular movie was shooting a scene in a motel room. What do most seedy motel rooms always have? Sex workers, but that's not important right now. What do they have in motel rooms that can sneak me into the room without the risk of physically getting thrown out? Smart TVs, which led me to a smarter idea. Create and star in my own TV show that I'll sell to networks, have it go straight to series so it'll run on the TV while they're filming. Turns out that's really hard to do. But what I do know is that on film sets, time is money. So I have to get myself on that TV so they can't get me off. Okay, so I couldn't create and sell my own TV show in enough time, but I could create some low-level content that would blend in with the common late-night programming seen on most motel TVs. What plays on motel TVs that wouldn't raise any red flags? Infomercials. Infomercials play on loops all the time and are usually so boring it could go unnoticed. So here's what I made. Millions of men have fallen victim to the one thing that is unavoidable, male pattern baldness. It steals your style, it steals your confidence, it steals your pride. Well, not anymore. Not with the Bald Buster 3000. I'm just busting your balds. Here is your natural hairline. What happens is this starts to recede back here. Then as the crown starts to go, it's going to meet the receding hairline in the front. And guess what? It leaves you with a cul-de-sac that nobody wants to drive down to visit you. Not even your mother. You're going to see your ex-wife driving circles around there. She's never going to stop. She's never coming back. Then you start getting desperate. You don't know what to do. A lot of men, they start off by covering it up with a tiny hat. That's right. They put the hat on their head. They go out. They get back to her place. The hat falls off. She just got hat fished. Nobody likes that. Nobody wants you there anymore. And now you're home alone. What do you do next? You go to the extremes and you try hair plugs. Look at this process. They come in, they have a tool like this. Look at this. Ow, 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 ow. Look at this guy. He's miserable. You're being tortured. It doesn't look natural. Well, guess what? That's all in the past with the Ball Buster 3000. Get ready because I'm going to bust your balls. This non-invasive treatment really works. You don't believe Mr. Mellon? Well, how about a success story? Me. Before this, I had a patchy beard. Embarrassing. After six months of using the Ball Buster UV treatments on one side, you'll see the results. That embarrassing patchy thin beard is now gone. This guy is successful. This guy, total loser. This guy's a stud. This guy's a dud. This guy is screwing this guy's wife. This guy's a rock star. And this guy's still pitching his white rapper demo CD out of the trunk of his car. This guy, everybody wants to know who he is. This guy, not so much. This guy's a movie star. This guy's still pitching that screenplay outside of the Ralph on Vonland. This guy's kids love him. This guy's kids don't even call him dad anymore. This guy, huge <laughs> This guy is still pissing on his balls. This guy lives with his mother. This guy lives with his mother's hot friend. This product gives natural results. It's amazing. The ball buster hits it out of the park. You're gonna get your hair back. You're gonna get your confidence back. You're gonna get your life back. Maybe you'll get your kids back. 
I don't know, that's a whole legal thing. But at the very least, you're gonna be a weekend dad with a full head of hair. And maybe they'll stop calling Dan Stevens dad and call you dad again. Order now. Hopefully I make it in the shot. If I do, you guys will know the secret backstory to that random pitch guy on the TV. So, the science. How did I get myself in there? Simple. This is a thumb drive. On the back of almost every basic ass smart TV is a USB port. Now all I needed to do was upload my infomercial on a loop to the thumb drive, then mail it to my inside person and have him insert it to the back of the TV, like so. The best part is it's practically invisible, so no one will find it. And now this TV is running Mike Cape's television 24 hours a day. This crew's gonna have a real hard time getting me off and not because of my ED this time. I unfortunately couldn't get near the closed set to find out if it worked. So this is where my inside man will give us a little visual confirmation with the magic of cellular technology. Check this out. Dude, the channel won't change. Hey Rob, the channel won't change in here. Then you start getting the channel to change. You don't know what to do. A lot of men, that's why. Holy shit! I'm just as amazed that that shit worked as you guys. I better not lose my job over this. Are we square? Yep, we're square now. No one's ever gonna find out that you were the one who filmed that Tom Cruise set freak out. Wait, you idiot, you're not supposed to say that. Thanks, John. This impossible mission is now accomplished. So far. Now, I don't know if I actually made it into the finished movie because it hasn't come out yet. Will I still be seen or heard in the background? We'll find out together. So watch Paranormal Activity Next of Kin, October 29th on Paramount Plus. I'll even live feed my first watch at home. So follow me on Instagram to find out. Here's what I can show you from the trailer so you know what you're in for. I like your doll. What's her name? Chilling. Well, you get the idea. Actually, the movie looks great. So be sure to watch it and see if I pulled off my most challenging hack yet. And if you see me in it, let me know in the comments section. All right. Now that I've snuck myself into the background of a big studio movie, it's time for me to step into the foreground of my own movie. In order to take this Hollywood hack to the next level, I have to have something to show. How am I gonna do that? I wrote a full movie of my own, and it's not to get my apartment moved this time. I'm talking about a real full-fledged masterpiece. It's a movie about an invisible raptor. It'll win tens of awards, and I'm gonna make it with your help and get this sucker into theaters. Well, home theaters. Why a movie about an invisible raptor? I wrote a monster movie adventure like the ones that inspired me to make movies in the first place. But the one thing about Hollywood monster movies is that they're super expensive to make. Unless you cut out the most expensive part, the monster. That's right. You can help me hack Hollywood by going to the Indiegogo link and chipping in whatever you can to make this movie a reality. Also, there's tons of cool shit that I'm giving as rewards for your contributions, including the Invisible Raptor action figure, and a chance to sneak yourselves into my movie. I promise it's gonna be worth it. Hold on to your buttholes and click the link below. And remember kids, don't be an asshole. Mike Capes here with a real doozy of a product, straight from the silver screen right into your bedroom. Coming soon to home theaters is a small scale Hollywood blockbuster called The Invisible Raptor. I wish I was invisible, that way my mom would get off my back when I bring a nice young lady home after 10 p.m. But with every great movie comes the merchandising, and most importantly, the toys. And boy oh boy, can these things be worth a ton of money over time if you don't open them. That could come in handy if you're behind on rent down the road and your mom won't get off your back about it. I'm just kidding, we're having fun here. But now, we're about to have a lot of fun with the product I'm here to show you today. The Invisible Raptor action figure. That's right, it's here. Roar! This action figure is action packed. Buy one to play with and buy another one to keep on your shelf as a collector's item that you don't touch just in case you need rent down the road. But make sure you hide it when girls come over unless they're into that kind of stuff. Ethically sourced in a shanty town on the outskirts of Amazon's state-of-the-art distribution center in Tijuana, the Invisible Raptor action figure is handmade using NASA-adjacent technology. 
a polyamorous thermoplastic elastomer that goes unseen by the human eye. Look at the fine detail here. Superior craftsmanship brings us a movie quality action figure that you're sure to play with for years to come. Even in your 40s, you'll forget the time and play for hours. Just be careful because your mom might think you're playing with your adult toy again. I'm just kidding, we're having fun here. Let's see it in action. Ow, 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 ow. It really hurts. The invisible raptor action figure can jump six inches. It can jump nine inches. Unbelievable. You can submerge him underwater up to eight inches. But be careful after that, it gets a little dicey. Not sure how long it can hold its breath. I was in a breath holding competition once as a kid. To the delight of onlookers, I was underwater for over 30 minutes, winning the contest. Until they realized I was legally dead and my friend's dad resuscitated me back to life. Turns out, I only held my actual breath for 13 seconds before my near-death experience. Now, I see ghosts late at night and I just block them out. Let's see what else he can do. Ow, 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 ow. Get your Invisible Raptor action figure now. What are you waiting for? It's a great gift for all ages. And if the judge ever lets you see a kid again, bring him one of these, he's gonna love it. Maybe you'll win him over and he'll call your dad again. Order now! Buying this toy does not guarantee custody or visitation rights. Not sold in stores. Beware of invitations. Call now.